So again, it should feel like air, you're going through air, and then it changes to water. Excellent. Make a mental note of, of what angle their legs are at. Okay, let's walk to the bottom of the table again, start at the bottom. Let's pick the heels up. And we're gonna do that double leg traction just to, just to start us off. Inhale, exhale, and use your body to lean back. Use your body, your body weight, and just lean back, looking at their body, and seeing how it's moving. And then ease off, place their, their feet down. Practitioners, take your left hand, your left hand, and bring it over to hook the foot, to lock the foot into the dorsal flexion. Good. So the right hand stays underneath. Yep. Left hand's gonna lock that foot. And we want to find that sweet spot. So lifting the leg up and out about 20 degrees, somewhere in that range, you'll feel where there's a very little resistance. Bottom hand does all the work. The top hand is just locking the ankle so it doesn't uh, traction on us. Let's inhale. As we exhale, lean back nice and light. The bottom hand does all the work. Use your body. Pretend you're water skiing if you want. Just lean back like you're water skiing. The bottom hand does all the work. And then ease off. Check in with your client. Did that feel okay? Any pain, can I go further? Perfect. Let's pick the foot up, same foot. Make sure the ankle's locked. Inhale, exhale, and lean back a little bit deeper. Use your body, use your body to lean back. The bottom hand does all the work. Watch for a second. Watch Everybody second. have an eye for a second. Stevie and I are going to have a, a little contest here. He's obviously weighs more than me, so come on. Let's, let's have it. So as we're doing this, we're having a bit of a contest here, right? But I'm muscularly, I'm pulling. Now watch the same thing when I do it like this. You actually get heavier when you relax. Very powerful. And yeah, with this hand, if you hook it under, and if you find it's hard on the thumb, you can take this top hand and just wrap it around so the forearm goes across the ankle here. We're not pressing on the forefoot at all. The forearm goes across the ankle, and then you can just lean back that way. And then you don't have to worry about the hand or the thumb pressing the foot. Does that feel okay? One very dumb thing. Yep. Did that feel similar between the two? Beautiful, good job. The, uh, the top hand can either be locking here, but if you find the foot is big or if it's hard on your thumb or anything, you're just gonna wrap the form across the ankle, and then the hand on the side of the calf will add that little support, and then there's no pressure on the foot, no traction on the ankle, right? So we've got our hook, we lock it into place, we find that sweet spot, wrap it up. So Vaughn, inhale for us. And as he exhales, I exhale, my body. Did that feel okay? Let's do one more inhale. And exhale. 